in Bangkok, Thailand. Today I am showing you train night market Rachata. This is my favorite night market. It's actually open every single day from 11 a.m. till midnight, but I think nighttime is the best time to go because you really get the night market, the Thai night market feeling. This place first opened in January 2015, so it's pretty modern compared to Chatuchak. Chatuchak is very old. Like when you walk there, you can see it's very outdated. And I think this place has a lot of more modern sellers. For example, all the clothes, shoes, and accessories are way more trendy here than at Chatuchak. At Chatuchak, it was more traditional items and a lot of imported touristy items. But here, some beautiful things. And first, I found takoyaki, which I absolutely love. I love Japanese food. So I was very happy to see this here. Oh, this is salmon. I try it with salmon. I think it's still a little bit raw. I think I had better ones. Rachada has a huge variety of foods, drinks, bars, restaurants, stalls, and shops. But for the food, I think it was probably the best place to come. Uh, I mean, I'm sure there's other places too, but compared to Rach uh, Chatuchak, this one had better food options. It's a lot more cheaper too. Um, the skewers here were super cheap and even the clothes are cheaper than at Chatuchak. And as you can see here, it's way more modern. I have a separate video just on Chatuchak. I'll put it in the bio. Um, you can kind of compare the stuff that you see here. I know I did not show a lot of clothes and stuff, but I, honestly, I just came for the food because I was starving and I was not disappointed. There are so many amazing smelling aroma in the air so many items to choose from but i really wanted to sit down so i'm gonna pick up another skewer i got an octopus it was lacking of salt and seasoning fresh off the grill a little hot After oh my god it's hot oh my god Spicy? After grilling it, they dipped it in spicy oil. <clears throat> How much was it? 40 baht. Dollar 25. Like a dollar 25. For two? For two skewers, a dollar 25. I spent 10 days in Thailand and I've come to realize that they prefer for spices seasoning they prefer sugar over salt so a lot of the foods that were supposed to be salty were actually sweet and the skewers unless it's like grounded meat there was not a lot of salt or pepper or anything these are sausage balls i did not try them uh because I was looking for a restaurant where I can sit down, which are in the middle row. And I was actually pretty happy with what I chose. I'm going to show you in a little bit. But as you can see, there's so many foods to choose from everywhere you look. There's something cooking. You're going to find, if you're a picky eater, you're going to find something that you like to eat. And I also tried um, chicken tenders like the KFC chicken tenders, and it was absolutely amazing. But I was so hungry, I totally forgot to video it, but it was delicious. And you can always grab an alligator skewer or another kind of skewer, but for these ones, again, they do not put salt on it. They just dip it in chili oil or you can eat it as is. Personally, I would prefer something like this over the meatballs or the fish balls because at least with these, I know what I'm eating and what's in it. Liver. Oh, so good. Soft on the inside, a little crunchy on the outside. Only 10 baht. What's that, like 30, 
30 cents. 30 uh, cents? 18 cents. Watermelon no, smoothie. Cents. There's a watermelon smoothie, 50 baht. That's like a dollar. Dollar what? Dollar 80? Almost two dollars. Mm. Less. We decided to sit down on this restaurant and there was a two people plate, two persons plate for 490 baht. It was about $14 and it was totally worth it. The fish was totally worth it. The inside was super soft and juicy. The shrimps were, again, no seasoning on it, no salt, nothing. It was a little overcooked. Look at those long whiskers. The noodles in the middle were cold. The, the chung beer, it's a Thai beer. It was so good. I'm even looking for where I can buy them here in America. I found them at Total Wine. See, we ate all the fish and shrimp. The shells... Um, I found blood in the shells. Is that normal? I had no idea shells can bleed. Someone tell me, is this normal? I need a dessert, so I found this ice cream covered in toasted marshmallow and caramel sauce. I'm gonna end this video after the ice cream. Thank you so much for watching. Check out the other videos on Thailand if you're interested to see more. <laughs> messy it's messy to eat the ice cream is actually delicious the marshmallow is very thin and very fluffy i think i'm gonna wait a little bit until the ice cream melts a bit it's more like a sorbet <laughs>